Hey guys, so we get a lot of questions uh, from people wanting to customize this Rise demo. Um, and they're making a change to like the custom style sheets over in design. And the changes are not being picked up. So I'll just show you how to do this. So um, what you want to do is go into design. Down, always download your template files first so you've got a backup. Once they're downloaded, go into edit HTML CSS. Now the issue is, if you're on, say, the HTML, say you want to edit any of these files, like the color.css file, and you go in here, and you make your changes, and nothing's happening for some reason. It's it's not updating. Then the reason for that, if you go back to HTML head, or you go default, click on HTML head. The reason for that is this is pointing to a template path, which is not the actual file that you're editing here on the left. So what you need to do is update the path to the ones on the left here. So you would go change it to this. So it's forward slash templates, forward slash underscore, underscore custom. And then it's forward slash styles and color. Same thing goes for, say, if you wanted to edit um, this one, if you're editing custom over here, right, if you're editing that, you want to change that path. You want to change, take out this global TPL path and change it to that. So anything you want to edit, do that, and then your changes will be picked up in the style sheet. So once you start editing color.css, the changes will load on the front end here. Okay, hopefully uh, that answers any questions. Um, it is something controlled by how Big Commerce has done their uh, their templates and the premium themes. So I do apologize. This is the only way that I can figure out how to sort of get this sorted for you. Um, hopefully in the future it's a lot easier. Thanks very much. Have a good day. Oh, one more thing. If for some reason, if for some reason that uh, there is a broken image or something, that means that the big commerce store is looking for the custom images in this path here. So what you would then need to do, the easiest thing would be to contact us, but what, what you would need to do is go to connect to the store via web dev, right? And remember that backup that you had? You would upload all of the image files into that um, template directory so it, so it knows where they are then. But normally if you're just changing colors and style sheets, Simply updating that path there to the style sheet that you want to edit will do the trick. Thanks very much.